Hey guys, what is up? What is up? I could have done like a couple of videos <clears throat> before, but I was like, mm, just going to relax, eat some, uh, some food, and yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, so um, I'm just gonna do some makeup. Um, not much really going on here. I have like this pimple or something on the side of my nose and I'm like, oh, no, <clears throat> but yeah, like nothing is really going on. Um, I'm actually going to use the illuminating primer. This is a lotion base. So it does have, um, the, like, a. it's not the clear stuff. Like the other one that I do use, um, I, I do like this one. Um, it does give you a hydrating, um, illuminating look underneath your makeup. Um, there are times that I have been getting really dry on my skin. So this does work a lot. Like, it's really nice. I do like it. Um, I just haven't really worn it, especially during the summertime or whenever it's, like, really warm outside. Just because it... it not me. <laughs> it's definitely not for me. But you can tell, like, kind of illuminating look here on the face. It's <clears throat> really good primer. I really like that. Um, <clears throat> I have been pretty much just using uh, pharmacy primer. I do have others. So if you guys want any other suggestions, um, I have Huda Beauty Hydrating Primer, which is really nice as well. Um, it's like a jelly base. Um, so that one is really nice. And then also, what else? There was another one that I really enjoyed, um, that I've gotten really, that I got in really into. And I just, yeah. Um, I am using the P. Louise eye primer right here. Um, I'm trying to use up a lot of products that I do have. So I pretty much put everything right in front of me that, um, <clears throat> that I do want to use for quite some time. Um, so I can just get through them as quickly, not as quickly as possible, but as quick as possible. Now pharmacy does not have this available anymore, but I am going to use the luminous, um, serum foundation. This is literally the best foundation and I wish they had never gotten rid of it. I'm deeply sad about it. I just, it sucks that it's not available, but I do still have some left and I just want to try to start using it up <clears throat> so that I can, yeah, use it. All right. So I literally have, let's see. Let's see, let's see. <clears throat> oh my. I don't I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hold on. <laughs> Alright, so I know what I'm gonna use. Um the Glam Light Michaela collection. So I just got this not too long ago and I'm really excited about getting this. Um, so it has, um, two of their, two of the lashes, which are super cute, code orange, very dramatic, and then also, um, brand, brand new, brand new, I don't know, so that's cool, um, the pressed highlighter, now this, the packaging is, oh no, super cute. I, I was about to rip the box by accident. Didn't even mean to. So the highlighter. I did post this on my TikTok as well. So <laughs> that is in there. Um, I'm so excited. I cannot wait to use this. Um, the lip sets with the lip glosses. So cute. I love it. And then, of course, the 
palette. Um, I've been wanting to use this collection um, since I've had it, but unfortunately, like time and stuff, I just haven't been able to. So like, look at that, I love it. Oh gosh, and then it is super pretty. So it does come with a nice big mirror. Let me take this off here. And we're definitely going to be using some colors. You guys, isn't this a pretty palette? I love it. I actually should have put this in my lineup, which I'll show you guys the lineup in just a minute, in a little bit, whenever I'm done with my eyeshadows. But I mean, can you guys take a moment and enjoy this palette? Like seriously, as I'm putting my grubby hands on the mirror. All right. <clears throat> So I am wearing like earthy green colors. I do want to use that, but granted, I kind of want to go in with some of like the, the yellow and the green. Uh, I was wondering what the, I forgot about this thing. And just so you know, I will eventually get the collection, the new collection that they do have out that just came out. Um, super pretty collection that they have for Glam Light, and I really want it, but obviously I'm gonna, it's gonna take some time. I'm going to just save up some money, some of my coin, and just get it. <laughs> All right, so <clears throat> I am going to use, um, this shade right here, it's called Loop. Such a pretty color. So I already primed my eyes love this and i'm gonna literally lay it right here on my inner corner and blend it in wow like look at that isn't that's so pigmented holy moly you guys have already seen a bunch of videos probably but oh my gosh i'm like super excited that i got this so i got this palette so I'm just like, it blends like a freaking dream. This is the first Glam Light product that I got from Glam Light. Or that I ordered from Glam Light. Um, now, there was some products that is from Glam Light, but was in a subscription box. So, I mean, I obviously got those. But, and they were like subscription collabs. Kind of, I don't know. There was this glam light palette that I got um, that I completely forgot that I had, and I had um, um, what do you call it? Um, I've had it for a while, so I just I don't know. I put it on an influencer. I forget. Love the shade. It's so pigmented. I love this green. Love this green. Um, if you guys do want to order anything from um, Glam Light, um, I follow a girl on YouTube and she does have a code. It is um, Allie, um, Allie Dawson. So if anyone is going on to um, Glam Light to order this collection or other collections, just use the code Allie um, and you can save some coins. All right, um, my next shade, I'm going to go, I'm actually going to go into with this shade right here. It's called Pot 2. <laughs> I, I, I hope I did not uh, butcher that, but, you know, it happens. It definitely happens. All right, so Pot 2. Oh, this kind of reminds me of Beetlejuice. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Beetlejuice colors, right? Beetle is it Beetlejuice or is it something else? I don't remember. Get Tell me in the comments, like the colors. 
Like, does this remind you of something? I'm still using the same brush with the green and I'm kind of like just mixing it in just a tad to like blend it in a little bit so that I can, so it doesn't like all look all liney. But, um, what do you guys think? Like, um, I know it's like, Paul, like, uh, uh, one of the movies. <laughs> I said feel juice like one too many times. <laughs> well, we know that it's fake. <laughs> Tell me in the comments though, like, what do you guys think? Like, is it good? Is it different? I don't know. Maybe it is a different movie. Maybe it is. I don't know. This kind of just reminds me, like, that blue or that green and purple kind of reminds me of something. I don't know. You know, you guys know what I mean though? Like I can't think of the word. Can't think of the movie of any kind. It just reminds me of it. I don't know. Maybe it's just me and I'm just thinking all weird. You know, just thinking weirdly. It's all good. Oh, I know. Okay, so I've been having like a hard time figuring out like what um Halloween movie I wanna watch today. I think I'm going to watch the first Harry Potter movie. I think that's what I'm going to do. All right. Um, right. I'm going in with this shade right here. It's called Freetown. Um, it's like a tealish kind of color. thought I heard something. Uh, I'm just going to go in. Tell me in the comments, um, should I, this month, okay, I, before you tell me, um, I will show you all the lineup that I'm going to use for this month, and, um, if you guys feel like I should just include this palette, because literally, you can do so much for this palette, like, there's your fall colors, there's like Halloween colors, as you can tell. Um, there is like, you can do so much with this palette and never get bored with it. So tell me in the comments, um, once you see the lineup, um, I will, and I'll consider like putting this into the lineup for the month of October. Pretty. I like it. All right. So I'm going to go in with, um, this shade right here is called stunning. Love it. So pretty and so buttery. This is one palette that I can seriously think that I would hand. 
I mean, I've panned a couple palettes already, but I just... Awesome. Okay, let me go in with that light, that, um, this shade called Freetown, and let me add that back in. Love it. Holy moly. So pretty, you guys. So pretty. I love it. I will go back in with that in just a minute. Um, I'm actually going to go in with the CoverGirl Peacock Flare Mascara. I got this through Ulta or ordered this through Ulta. I did a small Ulta purchase um, and it should be coming in sometime soon. I don't know when. But I'll show you all what I got when it does come in. Now, it does have, like, a lot of product on there, so I'm hoping that it does not clump my lashes. And it looks like it will. I think it has enough product as already, so I'm just going to Mascara kind of smells. <sighs> Alright, um, okay, hold on. Alright, so I'm going to go in with the Serum Foundation. And... Um, this foundation does provide full coverage if anyone wanted to know, but unfortunately, yes, I am, I do sell pharmacy, but this foundation does not, is not available anymore, which really does suck. Um, I really enjoy this foundation. It gives you that nice, luminous, healthy look. Um, I really enjoy it personally. Do I use it every day? No. But, um, I just, every now and again, I will open it up and just use it, um, because, you know, I did pay for it. I do want to use it. Um, do I use it every day on my lives? No, not really. Um, but I'm okay with that. Um, I just, I, I it just sucks. <laughs> I use sucks a lot, too. I'm sorry. It just definitely um, really crappy that they do not use it anymore. All right, so I am using um, the Too Faced uh, brow pencil that I got um, purchased through Ulta. Mm. Use this one so far, it's not so bad. I like the spoolie. Um, 
I don't know how much product there is in it, but I'm not really willing to find out. Um, but yeah, I do enjoy it. All right, so I'm going to put on some pharmacy concealer, you guys. Um, everyone always says that this concealer is like a, a dupe for the shape tape. I personally, I don't know. I don't think so because shape tape is a lot thicker compared to this. I think it's in a happy medium in my opinion, but I, I, it's just my opinion. Um, I don't think it is a shape tape dupe. But I also don't really particularly care for tooth or not Too Faced, uh, shape tape. Um, I pretty much just go in with that. So I'm going to go in with the same brush here and pretty much use what I have on the brush. Oops, probably added a little too much. It's okay. It's all good in the neighborhood. All right. Um, let's see. Um, let me put the face on. I'm going to use the bronzer and blush. At least. All right, and then oh, I think I got mascara on my contacts. Crap. All right. Highlighter, which will be the Glam Light Press Highlighter um, I am using for today. If I can open up the, the thing here. Highlighter. Oh, Ooh, wow. Pigmented. <laughs> I'm um, also going to put some on my inner corner here. Even though I already have that green shade might as well use yeah, I think I'm gonna watch I'm gonna definitely watch Harry Potter as my Halloween movie for today um, probably the first one yeah definitely all right, hold on. Okay, so I had to look for my lash glue. All right, hold on. All right, so I am actually going to be going in with um, brand new. Um, just because I I feel like the dramatic ones are not for me, but I will give them a try. Uh, one of these days. Just on that. So this one will go right here. All right. Yeah. Or, no, I think it goes this way. Yep. 
It's been a minute since I've put on lashes. I don't think I did it right. Or they're just way too long for my eyeball. I'm going to just go in with that. They're way too long for my eyeball. So, um, you guys are just going to not see me put lashes on because I think I'm going to have to, um, cut them, which sucks, but it's okay. It's all good. It's going to be okay. <laughs> all right. Um, I'm going to actually go in with the alter ego. I think we got some. I got some product on there. Um, the Alter Ego Euphoria. This is um, a liquid matte lipstick. All right, yeah, Euphoria, you can go on um, Alter Ego. And there's also codes that you can use to save up some money. I don't think this would be a perfect lip. Let's try some, this, uh, this shade, which is called Vanity. They are quite comfortable. Um, I don't think I did a very good job on the lips. I really don't think I did. But granted, I also have like something on my eye. All right. Um, I want to go in with um, this lip gloss that um, is in this collection. Doesn't have a smell. And it is not a sticky lip gloss or anything, just so you guys know if you are interested in getting this. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this look. I know the lips doesn't match. I apologize. If you guys have questions about some of the pharmacy products um, or the products that I used, please let me know. And I will see you all later. Bye, guys. All right. Hey guys, I am just going to show you like what I am quickly using this month. So I'm going in with the glam light, which was today, this morning that I did use on my Facebook live. I use this palette. So if anyone would like to see that, that will get posted very soon. Um, the Morphe Avani Greg, um, I'm going to be using this palette. I'm going to be using the Amoris cake pop, cake pop palette. Sorry. Um, Huda Beauty, um, the remastered version, um, Pharmacy Iconic Palette, I will be using that, the Jawbreaker Palette, 
Uh, the Narvina Collection number five. Lunar Beauty. And then also the Wonderless palette through Pharmacy as well. So let me know if anyone has questions about these palettes or if you guys think I should switch out one of the palettes. Tell me down in the comments and let me know. Like, um, do you guys think I should um, switch one of the palettes out and put this one in or just keep that one and have it at the ready? Um, just let me know and I will talk to you guys later. Tell me in the comments what you guys think.